Yo, what is going on guys? This is Rod from Altia Gaming TV and we got some good news. Red Dead Online Beta Early Access begins tomorrow, November 27th. Now I'm live on Rockstar Games. I'm showing you exactly what is happening right now guys. Red Dead Redemption Online Beta comes out tomorrow, but it's not for everyone. I'm going to read this properly, yeah? Um, now that everyone's had a chance, over a month to play the story mode guys. They are finally releasing Red Dead Redemption Online. Early access to the Red Dead Online beta begins tomorrow, which is Tuesday, November 27th. Working up to the full public access on Friday. So not everyone's going to have access to this tomorrow, guys. It's going to be those who have like the deluxe edition and they will be able to get it tomorrow. Everybody else will be getting it up on Friday. But not not that doesn't include the people that bought it early either. So they... We'll also get early access, but it won't be on, on Tuesday. So I'm going to read more so you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. Now, as it says, um, November 27th, public on Friday. All right, but up from the ground up, the latest news, Red Dead Redemption blends classical multiplayer of the original Red Dead. So if you guys didn't play the original Red Dead, um, the online was crazy. It was had like, a, I think about 30 people in a lobby. Nah, maybe about 25 open world free row and it was different type of lobby so you had a friendly lobby where you can't kill each other you had the outlaw lobby where everyone's just killing everybody and um you know it's a, it's a good place to to to, to relax on that right uh, we are reading about not really reading about our open world guys you guys already know if you play the story mode you already know about what's going on online so it says beta period and access the launch of the red dead online beta is the first step in that we will be continually expanding and that and dynamic world and the beta period will allow us to deal with inevitable turbulence of launching any online experience of the size and scale here you go here's the date this is what i'm looking for guys all right so on the tuesday the november the 27th which is tomorrow all red Dead redemption 2 ultimate edition owners right they will have access to it tomorrow this is players who really who bought the um physical edition have a Ultimate Edition code in the package, so make sure you didn't lose that. Right, on Wednesday the 28th, the day after, all the players who bought Red Dead Redemption 2 on the on October the 26th, according to our data, will be able to join it. So you don't even have to have the Ultimate Edition. If you do have the Ultimate Edition, you do get the game early. And those who bought it within the first week or couple of days of launch will get it on Wednesday. And on Thursday, all players who played Red Dead Redemption between October 26th to October 29th, according to our data. And of course, on Friday, everybody will have access to Red Dead Redemption 2. Now, the Red Dead Redemption Online data will be available to anyone who owns Red Dead Redemption 2 on PlayStation 4 or Xbox One starting Friday, the November 13th. But as said, some of us will have early access to it because just because we got the game early or we played the game earlier. That's all it is, guys. Um, let's, let's just talk about what's happening in the open world. So it says, with the gameplay of Red Dead Redemption 2 as its foundation... Reddit Online transforms the vast and deeply detailed landscape, cities, towns, and habitats of Red Dead Redemption 2 into a new living online world. That's that's what I'm going to be liking, guys. I ain't going to lie. And I'm pretty sure they're going to take stuff from GTA. Yeah, there you go. Look, create and customize your character, GTA. Tailor your ability to suit your player style. That's new, actually. So you're going to have to choose some certain skills that everyone's going to have different skills to start off with, then, I guess. And head out into a new frontier full of things to experience explore the world with solo we ain't doing that guys we're always that game of tv we're going to be running around with like 30 mans and horses man you know what i mean we're going to be with friends form or join a posse 100 percent, we're going to do that to ride up to with up to seven players all right so i think you can have seven players in the gang but i know there's 32 people in the lobby so gather around the fire at your camp head out hunting or fishing visit uh bustling towns battle enemy gangs we're definitely doing that and attack their hideouts. Hunt for treasure. Take on missions. Oh wow, there's missions as well. And interact with familiar characters from across the five states. Oh, oh wow. So that means there's a little story to it as well. All fight against the outlaws in both spontaneous skirmishes and pitch set piece battles. There you go. There's a little bit of uh, story mode online as well. Similar to how GTA 5 started with Lamar and the car. But um, I think obviously they're going to up it up it a notch. Complete with other players or whole posses in open world challenges and much more. I'm, I'm assuming, guys, online is going to be clothes, barbers, 
you know, feeding your horse, training your horse, buying horses, a little bit of car customization. Of like, but I'm not talking about the new cars, I'm talking about the old cars, all those horse carriages. But yeah, guys, that, that's about it, man. Red Dead Redemption 2 beta is out, it's coming out. So make sure you guys like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.